why Prince Harry and Meghan's baby may not get American citizenship. Will the upcoming British royal baby become an American? Possibly, but only if the royal parents-to-be do this one thing. The world has caught a bad case of royal baby fever ever since Kensington Palace announced that newlyweds Prince Harry and Meghan Markle have a wee one on the way. Elated British royal fans from all over the globe have already started making their baby predictions from names down to the time of day for the birth. And, Many have been wondering if the newest addition to the British royal clan will also become an American citizen much like his or her mum, Meghan. Don't miss the most likely name for Prince Harry and Meghan's baby. Naturally, by birthright, the baby will be born both a Brit and an American. The State Department says that children who are born abroad to married parents where one is American and the other is an alien will automatically acquire citizenship at birth. That's only if the American parent has been physically present in the United States or one of its outlying possessions for five years prior to the person's birth, at least two of which were after the age of 14. This stipulation only applies to babies born on or after November 14, 1986. For anyone else born prior to that date, the U.S. residential requirement for the American parent rises to 10 years. Aside from the citizenship laws, here are the 14 royal pregnancy rules Meghan Markle will have to follow. Despite the fact that Meghan and her baby to be meet both of these requirements, there's still one very important thing the new parents must do to get their child American citizenship, file a U.S. consular report of birth abroad. In order to function, like any of us, it will need documents and proof, and for that, you need to have it validated, Doris Meisner who was commissioner of the former Immigration and Naturalization Service under President Bill Clinton told the New York Times. This particular form from the American consulate will serve as the child's proof of U.S. citizenship and will also make him or her eligible to apply for a passport. Unfortunately, we will just have to anxiously wait for the baby to be born to find out. Next, learn how Harry and Meghan's baby will change the line of succession. Dual citizenship is, quite frankly, the dream. In a post-Brexit climate, but let's not talk about politics right now, okay? The ability to jet off and start a life in another country hassle-free is a welcome choice for those with two passports and tragically out of reach for those with only one. So, after Kensington Palace announced the wonderful news that Meghan Markle and Prince Harry are preparing for a child, we couldn't help but wonder, Will this child be able to add owner of green card to their seemingly never-ending list of privileges? For those of you who don't read the news, Meghan Markle, Prince Harry's wife of five months, is a U.S. citizen. The now Duchess of Sussex is a California native, and lived in America, with time out to live in Canada whilst filming suits, until her engagement to Prince Harry in 2017. Despite being literal British royalty, the 37-year-old did not become a British citizen after marrying her beau, and instead is going through the exact same procedure as other spouses of British citizens have to. Therefore, this baby, currently cooking in Markle as she works her way across Australia, will seemingly have dual citizenship. Dr. Deviani Prabhat, a researcher in migration, citizenship and nationality at the University of Bristol Law School, told Huffington Post UK. The royal baby will be entitled to both British and American citizenship as both countries provide for transmission of citizenship through blood links at least for two generations. Both countries permit dual nationality holding by their citizens. Though the parents will need to apply for passports, the child will be automatically entitled to both citizenships, no form filling needed. So, added to being seventh in line to the throne, owning crazy attractive genes, you were thinking it international fame for basically no reason, and therefore a whole lot of wealth, and really nice parents, this baby will also be able to work in the US no questions asked whenever they want.